I like to go back to when I was a child, uh, when we came home for our holidays in the summertime. It was nice to run and romp and swim and just have the freedom of, uh, you know, being home. My grandfather and my grandmother favored me, so I used to go live with them in the summertime up in Toba, Toba Inlet. My grandfather was a logger, and uh, in those days, they used a steam donkey to do the logging up there, and they logged there in the summertime, so I used to go and live with them up there. And then my grandfather used to go up at the head of Toba Inlet in this great big dugout. And we'd go up there and uh, right at the head of the river, they used to have these great big fish that were called Thais. That's, that's where he went and did his fishing. It was a big wide river, Toba River, I guess it was called. And we, we lived on a mud flats there. And my dad, dad was a good hunter, so he used to go hunting deer and he was a good fisherman. So all of these things we used to try and preserve um, throughout the you know summer. And we'd can it or uh, smoke fish uh, for the winter months. I know you hear a lot of bad things about residential schools, some of the trauma that um, children experienced. And I think the worst thing that really hurt my feelings was uh, not being able to um, communicate with my parents and uh, not getting the tender love and care that uh, a child needs. And, uh, and I think I missed um, getting hugs and, you know, being close to your, your family. We have a, uh, a traditional cultural way of um, like if you're, you're holding on to a lot of things that are you know bothering you you're worried about or you might be three or four things and you just get really overloaded um, what you do or what I did was I went out in, on my patio just before the sun came up and um, that's when you brush yourself off of the the problems that you can't really handle and you're giving them giving them away to the creator because you can't handle all of it. If people come to visit us here we, we usually like to uh, play that um, welcoming song because uh, um, not to move in our language is different people different cultures that come and visit and then we, we say that uh, we are really happy that you have come to visit us in our, in our territory.